Thanks for tuning in. Today we're going to be reviewing the Velocio Alpha Gloves Merino Air Jacket, Signature Long Sleeve Bio Jersey, and the Thermal Bib Knickers. The more the temperature drops outside, the harder it is to motivate yourself to ride outdoors. To address this, Velocio offers a wide range of cold weather apparel to keep you comfortable and protected from the elements while riding. In this review, we'll specifically be looking at a few cold weather items, including some of their Alpha products that we have here which feature Polartex Advanced Alpha Insulation. This cutting edge fabric enables Velocio to create lightweight and sleek cycling apparel that's far warmer than they actually appear. So you can see packaging wise, Velocio is really great about this. Everything is biodegradable. This is part of their better weight philosophy. So minimize all the emissions, contribute to 1% for the planet and use eco-friendly materials. Now we have quite a few items here, obviously. So we'll go through them individually. Starting with the gloves, these are the Alpha Gloves. They are $119, so very expensive for a pair of gloves, but they feature the Alpha insulation to create a really nice lightweight winter glove. They have the DV stretch soft shell on the exterior that's nice and windproof. And then on the inside, you'll find Polartex Alpha Direct insulation. So you can see nice and soft and a lot warmer than you would think given the lightweight of the gloves. They also have super, super Roubaix inserts on the side, which eliminates any gap between your wrist and the gloves. So these are the gloves. Basically, you get the gloves by themselves with a little tag that explains some of the Velocio branding and the size. Next, we'll look at the Merino Air Jacket. So this is $249. It's a lightweight winter jacket and it features the Alpha Merino wool insulation. So it combines Polartex Alpha insulation with the awesome material of Merino wool. So lightweight, breathable, and as you can see, it doesn't really look like traditional winter jackets. Has the same minimal branding, and it features their Pertex Quantum Air Shell, which is windproof and water resistant with the DWR treatment. You get three nice large pockets on the rear for storage, tall collars, and then you can see these lined sleeves and collar for extra warmth. Next, we'll look at the Signature Long Sleeve Bio Jersey. Retail price on this is $189. It uses climate friendly materials and has the same construction as the Velocio Signature Long Sleeve, but just more eco-friendly. It's UPF 50 rated and you have micro fleece lining on the collars and on the cuffs for extra warmth. It's a full length front YKK zipper. And then you have three large pockets on the rear as well as a zipper pocket for valuables. And then finally, we have the bib knickers. So retail price on this is $249. These are three quarter length knickers. They're the same as the signature bib tights, but obviously shorn down to about calf length to minimize the bulk. These have Thermo Roubaix power fabric. So these are fleece backed for nice warmth, but have great breathability and lightweight. They also feature Velocio's signature seamless microfiber bib straps, which are really lightweight. And as you can see, very comfortable with a nice mesh lining on the backside as well. It's all black, but you have the reflective Velocio logos for a nice subtle look and extra nighttime visibility. And then their proprietary signature camos that we find in a lot of their other products. So combined, this is a really nice kit for winter. It is a little bit pricey, but you get a lot of high-end features and the durability that Velocio is known for. No cycling kit is complete without a pair of gloves. The Velocio Alpha gloves are their take on a winter glove that combines their expertise with the Polartec Alpha insulation with sleek styling. So you can see it's a very lightweight glove and very warm thanks to that alpha insulation. If you look on the inside, you can see it's nice and almost like a fur-like finish that gives you warmth all the way through. You have a DV stretch shell on the exterior, so you can hear almost like a plastic-like material that is DWR treated, so it is water resistant and fully windproof. Velocio offers this in quite a few colors. We have the fire red here. But they also have more standard colors like black and olive that'll match other Velocio items. The fire red is almost like a dark orange 
and really attractive, so it pairs well with other items and highly visible. You have these black accents for all the different colors, so a nice non-slip texture on the hands, palm, and the edge. You have the Velocio reflective logos as well, with Velocio printed on the left glove. So nice design that really matches the rest of the kit. You'll notice the gloves don't have a cuff at the wrist. Instead of having the standard tab, it is extended out. So you can see it's a nice design that extends it further back and it'll actually hide underneath your jersey. And then in order to fill that gap, they use Super Rube inserts. So you can see that material here actually fills it out and kind of has elasticity. So it kind of fills out that gap it makes it so no cold weather gets through. It's a really nice setup and you can see very lightweight and highly flexible. It is not touchscreen compatible though. So you do have to watch out for that if you have a touchscreen GPS. You will need to use the buttons or set it up before you start riding. Described as one of their most technical riding jackets, the Velocio Alpha Merino Air Jacket uses the latest fabric technology to achieve a lightweight jacket with impressive warmth. Visually, the jacket has the classic Velocio look. You have a solid color scheme very minimal branding and with a couple of subtle accents here and there. Velocio currently offers this jacket in three different colors. You have the Moon Rock, which is gray, Deep Sea, which is dark blue, and then Fire Red, which we have here, which again is almost like a dark orange color and pairs well with their other products and has a lot of visibility. Now, what's really cool about this jacket is that it's a winter jacket, but thanks to the Polar Tech Alpha insulation with the merino wool, you get the best of everything. So it's a very lightweight, synthetic, and has the natural merino wool capability of breathability and warmth. So it's very lightweight despite being a winter jacket. You can see it's very thin, almost feels more like a jersey. The construction on this has a lot of nice features. You have a full length front zipper. You have a top zipper garage. You have the flap behind it that makes it windproof. So any wind that goes through the zipper gets blocked. And then if we open this up, you have a mid-length collar with this nice lining all along the edges to keep you warm and a mesh backing. So if we go ahead and open this up completely, you actually have dual zippers too, so you can adjust this as needed, which is pretty cool. So you can move this up and down and control the ventilation that way. So you can see on the inside, you have that nice insulation on the front piece and then a softer fleece backing on the rear for improved breathability. Really premium construction. Obviously, what do you expect at this price point? You have the reinforcements for the pockets on the rear. And then you can see the sleeves are all lined in this really nice soft material. If we look at the sleeves again, you can see you have the Super Robe inserts again. So this is a nice elastic material, and when you put it on, you can see how it stretches, and that prevents any cold weather from coming through. And you can even tuck your gloves underneath this. If we go to the back side, you can see a very simple design. You just have Velocio in the reflective color, and then on the top as well. You have three large pockets. So you can see really nicely reinforced and large enough for big phones. And they're very deep as well, so you can see how far they go with the nice reinforcements. And you can see the way they've constructed, it won't really sag, instead it has the flexibility to stretch out. You also notice that the rear has a classic drop tail. So you have this extra material here versus a standard shirt, which would be equivalent size. So when you're in aero position, you have extra coverage as well as the silicone gripper that keeps its location, so it won't really move up or down. It's a really nice design, and although pricey, a great option for winter riding. Velocio has taken their popular signature long sleeve jersey and applied their better weight mentality to create this more eco-friendly bio version. This jersey combines two climate-friendly yarns for a more sustainable and cold weather jersey. Velocio claims it can be worn down to 50 Fahrenheit weather by itself or layered up for additional warmth in colder weather. Unlike the other apparel, the long sleeve bio jersey is only offered in two colors. We have Moon Rock here, which is this nice kind of charcoal or gray color. And they also have a full black variation. The jersey retains Velocio's kind of minimalist design. So you can see no real graphics. You just have the Velocio logo on the chest. 
And then Velocio on the side pocket. So it really looks good, a nice timeless piece. You don't look like you're a NASCAR driver with a bunch of logos and advertisements on there. In terms of the construction, you can see full length front zipper. So single front zipper, you have the flap on the backside for wind resistance. Zipper garage on the top, which prevents the zipper from chafing against you. You have a tall collar to keep the cold weather out. And this actually has micro fleece lining. So you can see while this one is mesh and lighter, the collar is nice and soft. Same thing on the cuffs, you have that same material. So nice little detail and these are elastic cuffs as well. So again, when you put these on, it'll kind of eliminate any gap on your wrist as it has nice elastic material. You have raglan sleeves, so if you look at the seams on this, they extend all the way up to the collar, and that means you have a lot more range of motion, which is a nice feature you want in a cycling apparel piece. You have the extended rear, so you'll see how that extends further down, and that's great when you're in aero position, so you have more coverage, as well as the standard silicone gripper, which prevents this from moving around. It is a contour design. As with a lot of Velocio products, I would describe these as, as a race fit. So I would size appropriately. These are all medium size, which I found really nice. But you do want to, if you're on the edge, I would size up. You have three pockets, nice and deep. And again, big enough for big cell phones, as well as some reflective detailing, like this little tab. And then a zippered pocket, which actually goes behind the pocket and gives you a little bit of extra uh, storage space. So this is great for valuables like keys, cash. They don't really need quick access to and you don't want to fall out when you're reaching for food. So pretty slick overall and as with all our signature products has a premium construction and fit that makes a Velocio product so nice. With the Velocio Thermal Bib Knickers, Velocio has taken their popular winter bib type and modified them to be about calf length and create the knicker design. These feature the same fleece backing thermo power, thermo roubaix power material for nice warmth. So you can see that nice fleece like material and then extra wind blocking front panel, which keeps you nice and cool. So especially in winter riding, this can be one of the best investments you can do because it eliminates gaps between your leg warmers and then your bib shorts. So with the extended length, you get the nice warmth. And then if you wear longer socks, they'll tuck right underneath this. You see a lot of nice features like the little silicone gripper cuffs on the bottom. You have their seamless microfiber straps, which again, I think are one of the best features of Velocio bib shorts and bib tights. It's very soft and wide, so it won't really dig into your shoulders. They don't really get curled up either, as they're nice and soft. And then on the back, you have this nice transparent mesh material, which prevents you getting really sweaty, especially with a jersey and jacket behind it. So despite the fact that you have the bib straps, they really feel like standard shorts. Now, I highly recommend this over standard shorts. As you can see, you have no waistline, so no discomfort there and a lot more comfortable fit. This is stretchable in the front as well. So if you do have to take a bio break, you can kind of just pull this down or take it off completely, depending on what you need to do. The most important part about any bib shorts or bib tights is the camois. So this uses the elastic interface design. So this is the same as their signature proprietary camoa found in all, all their bib tights and bib shorts. So the same design, multi-density with a pressure relief channel. You have the zigzag stitching, the front cup that extends all the way front. So nice design and very comfortable on long rides. This is only offered in black, but as you can see, it has a multi-panel design with some of the reflective elements that keep you visible. So you have Velocio, and then on the other side, you have some other little reflective hits, like the little logo up here and on the bottom. So it pairs well with a lot of kits. And if we pull out the material, again, you can see really nice and warm. Here you can see the full kit on the road. We've paired it with our Smith Ignite helmet in a similar orange color. It's a great looking color set that really looks unique on the road and keeps you visible. We've layered up here with a base layer the signature jersey, and then the air jacket. You can see the jacket is nice and lightweight. You have that alpha insulation on the inside, which provides a lot of warmth without any bulk. Our favorite feature though, is probably those gloves. You can see you have a nice tight fit. It tucks underneath the sleeves of the jacket, 
So you don't have any air getting through, even though you don't have a Velcro strap or other mechanisms on the wrist. So a really nice combination, and even in low 30 degree weather or snow, you stay nice and warm and cozy. And as the temperature goes up, you can always open the zipper. On the rear, you have those big pockets, but it is a little bit bulky as they sag a bit. The knickers are probably one of the more unique pieces of the kit. It's a little bit of strange kind of niche product. You can see your bottom of your feet are actually exposed, so it's not a great item for winter riding, but if you're in the in-between weather, it's a nice option. Now let's go over the scorecard for the Velocio Winter Cycling Kit. We're going to grade the items on three categories, design, size, and in comfort. Starting with the Alpha Gloves, they're probably our favorite piece out of the kit. We give that an A plus for design. The nice and lightweight, but very warm. So a great option if you do a lot of cold weather riding. So even if you're doing steep descents at high speeds and 30 degree weather, your fingers stay nice and warm. So great option. And it's worth the extra price to have non-numb fingers. Size and comfort are an A as they really fit well and they're not bulky. The Marina Air Jacket also has that ALF insulation, which keeps it lightweight and warm. So we give it an A across the board. Again, quite expensive. But a great piece of kit as a jacket doesn't get a lot of wear and tear, so you can continue to use it for multiple years to come. The LS Bio jersey also gets an A across the board. It has everything we like about the signature jersey, but it's more environmentally friendly and fits really well. Thermal Knicker would give that a B plus for design. It's kind of those weird niche items as you have exposed skin on the bottom, so not a great item if you're riding in really cold weather, but if you're doing higher intensity rides in sort of medium temperatures and you want that colder weather to keep you cool down, that's a great option. It fits well and it's comfortable, so we'd give it an A on those categories. So overall, really nice piece of kit and we particularly really like the gloves. So if you wanna stay warm, I think these Polar Tech Alpha products really have a great leading edge over other products as they keep you warm without the bulk. Thanks for watching this review. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You can see more content from us on our website at thesweetcyclist.com as well as follow us on Instagram at thesweetcyclist. This is The Sweet Cyclist reminding you to enjoy the ride.